can't believe you're here. Are you in the right venue? Uh, yes, I am. My God, I can't believe you were just in India last week and now you're four here. Days in a, ago. Four days ago. and you're now here in Araneto City. Yes. What I brings just, you here? Well, I really wanted just to keep the momentum going. And like, I was so close in my last pageant. And yeah. I know Beanie Beaning is the next step for me. This has always been my dream pageant. And I've took, taken the necessary like steps to get to where I am. Uh -huh. And I just, I know this is my time. We didn't believe that it would be this. I didn't know that it will be so soon. Like Yeah, so soon. It was actually very last minute. I decided just the other day. Oh, alright. Yeah. So how was your experience submitting your application form over there? Really good. A while it was ago? So exciting. Like I can't yeah. believe that I'm actually here. Like it's unreal, honestly. Yeah, you just decided in a matter of days. Like, you were well, thinking contemplating the in the airplane. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Because I was deciding, do I want to take like a year off? Do I want to... Like, Wait, how old are you now? 24. Guys, see naman pala, 24 years old. <laughs> so, see? Grab it. So, assuming, you know, you're, you just submitted your application form. So, what do you think is the lesson that you... What lesson can you learn from your previous pageant system that you can now apply? Or you are you plan to apply here in Pinibining Pilipinas? The lessons that I can take, no matter what the negative or the positive is, always take it as a learning experience. And it was truly a blessing to be able to participate in an international pageant and see how well I can form and what I'm capable of. And honestly, just meeting the girls and making friends and enjoying every single step of the journey. Because that's what pageantry is all about. Whether win or lose, it's what those lessons you can take out of it. Yeah, your attack. Or your game attack or your... How will you plan? How will you attack your strategy? Well, I'm gonna do the same thing that I did in my international pageant. I'm just going to prepare because that's the best thing you can do. It's just plan my day-to-day -day outfits like strategically. Oh, we're right in front of a car. Um, work on my Q&A and just practice my communication skills overall. But I just want to have fun with it, and I think that's. One of the things I was lacking in my international that I was really caught up in trying to win so much that I kind of lost sight in having fun. And uh -huh. that's what I really want to do for Bini Bini this year. Oh. Because it's all an experience that I got. Sometimes talaga, no, pag, yun, yun, that's what I'm learning from you girls. The more giggle, it seems like the more you giggle towards a certain crown, the more it stays away or parang avoids you. Exactly. exactly. Yeah, parang the more relaxed you are, the more you kind of attract it to your side. That's what I've learned. Like, the more you have fun with it, it's just a better experience overall. Because I think I was so over-prepared and taking all the months of preparation to get, like, the international crown that I really lost sight of who I was. And then when I, the bad that I didn't win, it was kind of just like a, ah, oh, like, yeah. I prepared so much for this, but, like, what do I do now? And now that I can take that lesson into Beanie Beanie, it was truly like a humbling experience, even though it was just a few days ago. Yeah. But everything has a lesson. That's what life is all about. So now that you're here, which title are you aiming? MGI. Talaga? Lakas ng loob mo. Why? Talaga kaya mong maki- MGI is so fun. Like, I know, I know it can be a very controversial pageant, but I love it. Talaga. I think the production is amazing. I think the girls are absolutely beautiful. And you can, like, I can really be more of myself there. Uh -huh. I think that would be more of my peg. As in, like, Miss International, maybe a little more conservative. And that's, that's not really me. Uh -huh. Like, I am conservative in a sense, but MGI, I could really be myself. Oh my and God. I want something where I'm not afraid of to, like, show my colors. And I love the passerella. I really, I really want to do the passerella. You just want really to aura on the stage, really full time. But honestly, I'd be grateful for any crown. Like I wanna, I do have my goals, but whatever the organization would see me fit for anything, I would be grateful for. Like I can't be, I can't be picky or choosy. All right, la ask my last question. What can we expect from you oh, in Bini Bini this time around? I would say expect. The most Michelle that you've ever seen in any pageant. I'm I'm gonna be making a lot of friends this year. I'm not gonna be so shy this time. I want to just show my entire performance on stage and show the Q&A that I've been working for, how my communication skills have improved, 
and my styling of course. For sure you'll do well here considering that they give so much um, premium on girls who really, the, who really speak well. Yeah. And give substantive answers on Q&A. Yeah. Yeah, I can feel it. So a pageant okay. veteran ako na. You already have the international pageant experience, so you'll definitely be way, way up there in everyone's list. All right, Michelle. Sorry for this ambush interview. It's okay. Thank you. So it was lovely to see you. Yeah, kaya parang nagulat ako You'll see me soon. Sabi ko, huh? I sent you a picture of the application form, actually. I I haven't seen. I didn't. I have to check. Sorry, I got so busy the past few days. Nung sinabi mo ko niya sa akin na see you soon. Sabi ko, okay. I thought I'll see you. In the screening yeah, of the. Yeah, I sent you a picture of the beanie beanie, and I was like, to better things. Huh? <laughs> Sige, post ko mamaya. All right, thank you, Michelle. Thank you. Good so luck, much. and thank you for your time in doing this. Mwah. Take care, and see you soon.